The Badger's Redemption. Please subscribe. So you don't miss a new story. In the heart of the enchanted forest, where tall oaks whispered secrets to the wind and crystal clear streams giggled as they danced over pebbles, there lived a badger named Barnaby. Barnaby was notorious among the forest creatures for his ill temper and selfish ways. He scowled at the world from his burrow, refusing to share or lend a paw to any of his fellow inhabitants. The Fawn's Awakening One sunny morning, as Barnaby was out foraging for mushrooms and berries, he stumbled upon a delicate fawn trapped in a thicket. The fawn's big, doe-like eyes were filled with fear and tears as it struggled to free itself. At first, Barnaby couldn't care less about the fawn's predicament, but something deep within him stirred. Barnaby, begrudgingly, decided to help the fawn. With his strong claws, he carefully unraveled the thorny mess that held the young deer captive. As the fawn bounded away, its eyes now filled with gratitude, Barnaby felt a warmth in his heart that he had never known before. Word of Barnaby's act of kindness spread like wildfire through the enchanted forest. Animals who had once shunned him began to reconsider their opinions. One by one, they approached him, their eyes filled with curiosity and hope. A wise old owl named Ophelia, who had observed the entire scene from a nearby branch, approached Barnaby with a twinkle in her eyes. She said, Barnaby, my dear friend, I saw what you did for that fawn. It was a selfless act of kindness, and it has not gone unnoticed. Barnaby, still surprised by his own actions, replied humbly, I don't know what came over me, Ophelia. I just felt compelled to help. Ophelia nodded and said, Sometimes, kindness lies dormant within us, waiting for the right moment to blossom. You have discovered the magic of compassion, Barnaby, and it has the power to change your life and the lives of those around you. The Forest's Collective Heart News of Barnaby's uncharacteristic act of kindness soon spread through the forest, piquing the curiosity of his fellow animals. One by one, they began seeking him out, sharing their problems and asking for his help. Initially, Barnaby resisted, growling and snapping, but slowly, he began to listen. He found himself offering solutions, providing advice, and even working together with others to solve their issues. One day, a family of birds approached Barnaby, their nest hanging precariously from a swaying branch. The father bird, a vibrant cardinal, explained, Sir Barnaby, our nest is about to fall, and we don't know what to do. We've heard you've been helping others, and we thought you might have a solution. Barnaby studied the situation, his sharp eyes focused on the swaying nest. With a thoughtful expression, he said, I may have an idea, but it will require some teamwork. He gathered a group of animals, including squirrels and chipmunks, to support the branch while the cardinals carefully reinforced their nest. The combined effort saved the bird family's home. Word of Barnaby's second act of kindness traveled even faster than the first. Animals from all corners of the enchanted forest began seeking his advice and assistance. Soon, Barnaby was hosting regular gatherings where creatures of all shapes and sizes could come together to share their problems and work collaboratively to solve them. As the days turned into weeks, Barnaby became the most sought-after advisor in the enchanted forest. His reputation shifted from being the most selfish to the most selfless creature around. But something even more remarkable happened, the forest creatures began to emulate his behavior. They started helping one another without hesitation, recognizing the power of unity and cooperation. One sunny afternoon, as Barnaby watched a group of animals working together to build a bridge across a stream, he couldn't help but smile. The forest had transformed into a place of harmony, where friendships flourished, and every creature knew they could count on one another. Ending One clear moonlit night, as Barnaby sat by his burrow's entrance, surrounded by friends of all species, he realized the profound change that had come over him. He had gone from a grumpy recluse to a respected and cherished member of the forest community. The forest's animals had learned a valuable lesson from Barnaby's transformation. They understood that even the most stubborn and selfish among them could change and become a force for good. They realized that kindness had the power to unlock the hidden potential in everyone. The Badger's Redemption teaches us that even the most hardened hearts can soften and open when touched by acts of kindness and empathy. It reminds us that change is possible, even in the most unlikely individuals, and that the power to make a difference lies within each of us. Just as Barnaby transformed from a grumpy badger to a beloved friend, we, too, can choose to cultivate compassion and understanding, thereby creating a more harmonious world where kindness is the guiding light in our lives. Like the enchanted forest, our world can become a better place when we embrace the transformative magic of kindness. The End Don't forget to subscribe.